Hello, District 1 residents and fellow South Fulton citizens. It is my honor to represent this growing and diverse district. I'm Councilwoman Dr. Katherine foster Rao, and I'm excited about the growth we have in our area. One of our proudest accomplishments in District 1 has been the complete renovation of the Sandtown Recreation Center, including the exciting addition of workout equipment and a new game room. This revitalization project has provided our community with a modern, inviting space for recreation and social gatherings. We've also seen tremendous growth in our local economy, with the addition of new retail businesses at Sandtown Crossing. The opening of Chipotle and Starbucks has not only brought convenient dining options to our doorstep, but has also attracted new visitors and investment to our district. Another significant accomplishment has been the development of the Rock Haven townhomes and the associated traffic improvements at Stonewall Hill and Camelton Road. These enhancements have not only provided much needed housing options, but has also alleviated congestion and improved traffic flow in our area. Lastly, we've taken proactive steps to enhance safety and quality of life for residents with traffic calming installations at Enon Pines and Boat Rock Road. These measures have made our streets safer for pedestrians and motorists alike, promoting a sense of community well-being. There's no district like the number one district in the city, District 1. I'm immensely proud of the progress we've made in our district. I remain committed to the residents to serve with dedication and integrity. Let's continue to build a city where every voice is valued and heard. Greetings to the residents of the City of South Fulton and District 2. I am your Councilwoman, Carmelita Gums, and it brings me remarkable joy to talk about all of the accomplishments we have achieved together here in the City of South Fulton. One of our proudest achievements has been the launch of our Senior Health and Wellness Programs, a testament of our unwavering dedication to our senior community, our legacy residents. Recognizing the needs for such initiatives, we provided essential resources and support to ensure the well-being of our beloved seniors. Our commitment to environmental sustainability has also been a priority. Addressing the critical issues of microplastic pollution, we've implemented policies and initiatives to safeguard our waterways and environments, setting an example for the entire city. Cultural diversity is another cornerstone of our efforts. Through the reopening and the expansion of the Wolf Creek Amphitheater, we created a vibrant, we've created vibrant spaces for cultural exchange and celebration, enriching the lives of our diverse community members. And finally, promoting economic development and enhancing quality of life has been at the forefront of our strategic initiatives. By fostering partnerships and advocating for infrastructure improvements, we're ensuring that our city continues to thrive and evolve for the betterment of all residents. I'm immensely proud of the work that we have accomplished together here in the district. I remain committed to serving you, the residents in the city of South Fulton with passion, dedication, and integrity. Together, let's continue to build a stronger, more vibrant, and healthier city of South Fulton in District 2, the crown jewel. Hello, I am Councilwoman Helen Zenobia Willis in the city of South Fulton, District 3, and I am honored to serve a vibrant and thriving community. One of our biggest accomplishments in advocating for the establishment of a dedicated precinct right here in District 3, this initiative not only enhance safety and security for our residents, but will foster stronger bonds between law enforcement and the community. Another significant achievement has been our concerted efforts to address blight within our district. By tackling this issue head on, we will revitalize neighborhoods, improve property values, and provide residents with safer and more dignified living conditions. I am particularly proud of the transformation we brought to Welcome All Park. The renovation of the weight and fitness rooms has not only encouraged healthy lifestyles among our residents, but has also created a welcoming space for community gatherings and recreational activities. Last but certainly not least, our commitment to enhancing recreational facilities is evident in the renovation of the tennis courts at South Fulton Tennis Center. These upgrades have provided tennis enthusiasts of all ages with top-notch facilities to hone their skills and enjoy their favorite sport. In conclusion, I am proud of the work and progress we have made in District 3. I am honored to serve a resilient 
and vibrant community. Together, we will work to enhance the lives of every resident and city of South Fulton. District 3 is the place to be. Hello neighbors of District 4 and citizens of the city of South Fulton. This is council member JC Sebastian and I'm honored to have served as your city council member for the last few years in our beautiful, vibrant and growing community. Go with me now on a journey as we show some of the things that has been happening in your area. On day one, one of my primary goals was to develop a strong community culture in District 4. Through events like Fire and Ice, our Fall Festival, Community Christmas Tree Lighting, the annual Autism Sensory Festival, and hosting the Slingshot Festival, we have created opportunities for residents to come together, celebrate each other, and build strong, lasting relationships. I'm proud to have led the way in rolling back the city's millage rate for the first time in its history. This not only saves residents money, but also demonstrates our commitment to fiscal responsibility and efficient government. In addition, I've worked tirelessly to address food insecurity within District 4 and the surrounding areas by regularly hosting food giveaways in collaboration with Community Marketplace and the Atlanta Food Bank. I have worked tirelessly to address the needs of our community. Some of my main projects have focused on improving the quality of life for our district. From cleaning up the Bishop Road landfill to supporting the City Grove Road Village Center development. A $400 million development that will bring many of the amenities we need. Infrastructure and safety enhancements for Jones, Hall, Hobgood, Derrick, Ono and White Mill Roads have been completed or are on the way. And I am collaborating with state representatives to enhance safety and infrastructure in our district, especially along Highway 92 and South Fulton Parkway. I've also been a strong advocate for public safety and economic development. I have pushed for full police precinct at the shops at City Grove Plaza and Fire Station 6 expansion. That will also include a small community room for our meetings. I've worked to improve and support small businesses by collaborating with them on many of our community initiatives. And we made history when we had three ribbon cuttings back to back to back on the same day. I am grateful and honored to have served as your councilman and mayor pro tem, and I'm committed to continuing our work to make District 4 and the city of South Fulton a safe, vibrant, beautiful, and prosperous community for all. Thank you for your continued support and encouragement. Again, I'm JC Sebastian, council member for District 4, where you get more. I'm honored to serve as your District 4 council member, and I'm committed to making District 4 and the city of South Fulton a safe, vibrant, prosperous, and beautiful place to live. Remember, in District 4, you get more. Hello, residents and the fellow citizens in the city of South Fulton. I am Councilwoman Kiosha Bell and I am super excited and thrilled to share some of the wonderful achievements and accomplishments that we've achieved right here in District 5. District 5 is home to one of the primary commercial corridors in South Fulton. This vibrant area has long been a hub of economic activity, offering a wide range of services and amenities to residents and visitors alike. Our district is also known as the Entertainment District of South Fulton. With its diverse array of restaurants, bars, and entertainment venues, District 5 has become a destination for those seeking a night out on the town. Old National Highway, once the premier shopping destination in the South Metro area, remains a vital artery in our district. Its proximity to key transportation hubs, including Hartsfield Jackson Atlanta International Airport and major interstates, makes it an attractive location for businesses and residents alike. The vibrant business community on Old National Highway is a testament to the entrepreneurial spirit of our district. 
With over 500 establishments offering a variety of goods and services, this area continues to thrive and grow. In conclusion, I am super proud and excited for the progress that we're making here in District 5. I am fully committed to continuing our efforts and the work to make sure that our district remains vibrant and thriving for all who live here and call it home. We're keeping it live in District 5. Greetings and salutations and welcome to the sensational 6th District here in the city of South Fulton, a city on the rise. I am Natasha Williams Brown and it has been my privilege to serve as the council woman for District 6 for the past two years. We are here today at the city of South Fulton Economic Development Office to talk about just a few of the accomplishments that I have had over the past two years that I have been your city councilwoman. And what better place to start the story than right here in the building that was my first accomplishment as your city councilwoman. Opening the City of South Fulton Economic Development Office here on the Old National Corridor was not only a testament to the work that's been put in to revive the Old National Corridor, but also stands as a beacon and a symbol to the business community that the City of South Fulton is open for business. Since opening this office, there have been a number of businesses that we have brought in line, including the Crestwood Event Center, which has given the City of South Fulton the only class a event space in the city and also is going to serve as the new home for the City of South Fulton Municipal Court. In addition to the Crestwood Event Center, there are other businesses that are coming online, such as the Valvoline, which is being built directly across from the Economic Development Office, the Chipotle, which is planned to break ground soon, and just down the sidewalk, we have a Five Below that is coming online effective May 17th. These are just a few of the things that I have accomplished since becoming your councilwoman in 2022. It has been an adventure, it has been an honor, it has been a pleasure, and I am so proud to represent the 15,000 residents that call the District 6 here in the city of South Fulton their home. I invite you to come experience all that the old National Corridor has to happen. Come live, work, play here in District 6, and certainly don't just meet me there, but meet me there. Again, I am Councilwoman Natasha Williams Brown, representing District 6 here in the city of South Fulton, a city on the rise. Buenas tardes and hello to the residents and citizens of the city of South Fulton. I am Councilwoman Linda Pritchett and it's been my honor and pleasure to serve you as your Councilwoman since December 2022. I am extremely excited to share with you some of the significant accomplishments that we have achieved in our district together. One of our top priorities has been improving traffic safety. In less than six months, we successfully installed a traffic light at the intersection of Jonesboro Road, known as Highway 138 and Bethsaida Road, followed by another light at Jonesboro Road and Peters Road. These measures have not only saved lives, but has also reduced accidents in our community. We've also taken proactive steps to address blight in our neighborhoods. By demolishing blighted properties in the Lake Royale subdivision, we're revitalizing our community and creating safer, more attractive environments for residents. Community engagement has been a cornerstone of our work. Through our community newsletter reaching over 2,500 residents and hosting town hall meetings on various topics, we've ensured that the voices and concerns of District 7 residents are heard and addressed. Additionally, we've organized a multitude of community events and initiatives, including food truck madness, back to school supplies giveaway, wellness day activities, and the international farmer's market, enriching the lives of our residents and fostering a sense of unity and belonging. My goal has always been to make a tangible impact and improve the quality of life for all the residents in the city of South Fulton. Together we have achieved so much, and I look forward to building a stronger and more vibrant city of South Fulton, a city on the rise.